The Department of Agriculture is ramping up its efforts to exterminate an invasive pest, the yellow-legged hornet. Although the hornet has not been spotted outside the Savannah area, leaders say they need the community's help to keep it that way, as the hornet threatens pollinators and our state's number one industry, agriculture. Georgia Department of Agriculture exterminated five yellow-legged hornet nests all in the Savannah area last year. They say between August 2023 to April 2024, they used over 220 traps and exterminated seven total nests. Officials say they're working day in and day out to make sure this invasive pest does not spread outside of the Savannah area. We are very, uh, very seriously stepping up our efforts for 2024. Um, with the goal being complete eradication of this hornet. 100% need the public's help in this fight. Um, the more eyes we can have looking out for these things, the better. On your screen now is what you should be on the lookout for. According to the Georgia Department of Agriculture, a yellow-legged hornet size is about two centimeters long, and they have a narrow waist. The bottom half of its legs are yellow, and the bottom half of its body near its stinger is yellow as well. They say if you remove an embryo nest, it's important to make sure you exterminate the queen as well. And really, you know, if you think about some of Georgia's most iconic crops, whether it's Georgia peaches, South Georgia watermelons, blueberries, all of those crops will require pollination um, to be successful. So if these hornets were allowed to establish, it could potentially threaten those industries and the livelihoods of our farmers. The Georgia Department of Agriculture asks that if you come across a nest in Queen, please take a photo and report it using their special form or by sending them an email. For more information on that form and email, just find this story on WALB.com.